everybody, what's going on? It's Mr. Hino with Mr. Hino's LEGO Robotics. And I got the LEGO EV3 Samurai. Check this dude out. Wah! Wah! This guy is so cool, man. I'm going to show you today what this thing looks like, how this ultrasonic sensor works, how this thing... I mean, I've told you guys before, it is so awesome when you take LEGO EV3 robots or Spike Prime and make it look so realistic. Like, look at that sword and this samurai. It's just so cool. So today I'm really excited. I'm gonna jump on this robot to show you because I'm just so excited. Okay, I cannot take credit for this build. I'm not sure who the original builder, owner of this is, but I got this from the YouTube video, Mr. DeZwang. I'll leave you a link um, in the description for the building instructions for this. It goes really quick, so you're gonna to have to be, you know, pause it every like few seconds. I will be honest also, um, some of these were expansion pieces. Um, I think you can get these EV3. I think those were expansion too, but I got these out of my Spike Prime kit. So if you're thinking, I'm just gonna open up my EV3, it's gonna take some expansion pieces too. So just be forewarned about that. But this guy's so cool. If you got the pieces, it's really worth it. Okay, so I'm gonna go ahead and show you the details of this guy, and then I'm sure you're here to see this guy in action. So let's go to it. Okay, so on the Samurai, here we go. Here's the brick. It's gonna be in the back. It utilizes two large motors to power this thing up, and it uses the medium motor to get this guy to raise his arms like that, and whew, I really like that. I've never seen that before where the medium motor, when it comes down, actually twists, like this guy is actually swinging this sword. Look at that, that is so awesome. And then to utilize these pieces to make this look like a samurai, come on, that's just really cool. And so you don't have to utilize this, but in the program, we can use this uh, distance sensor ultrasonic to see if anything's coming up and then use that to have this guy attack. And then down here, Here's where you can kind of kind of get a glimpse. There's some expansion pieces right there. Um, expansion pieces, I'm trying to figure out. Let's see. Yeah, that dude. Nope, that's not expansion. There were some of these where it's expansion and you just have to be careful. Um, and I utilized some of the pieces. You remember I put my EB3 kit together with, um, you know, I had to uh, supplement some of these. So that's why you might see a different color on some of these pieces but let's go ahead and show you what the program might look like let's show you how you can manually if you have the commander app control this samurai Now my motor control. Okay guys, so there you have it. The EV3, <laughs> EV3 Samurai. I really like this one. It's just one of those ones where you come across it, you see it and you're like, I gotta build that one. This is, guy was just so cool. Um, I appreciate again, Mr. Zizwang for 
uh, allowing the building instructions to be here on YouTube to build this guy. And just look at that. That's just so cool. So I hope you guys really enjoyed it. Thank you guys so much for watching. I am Mr. Hino from Missions Lego Robotics. I and the Samurai are out. He's out. He's out. We got this. We got this. We got this, guys. Hey guys, Mr. Hino here. Thank you so much for watching. And if you love robotics, don't forget to check out these videos also because they're cool. Okay guys, take care.